Hi guys, how are you doing today? So it's me and Lulu, and here's my face. Sorry about that. Um, we're gonna talk today about this. Now this is a head collar, and I promise you, this will be one of the best things that you can buy for one of these dogs, okay? Now, I don't advise these at an early age. As a puppy stage, you want harnesses, because of their faces still developing and their muscles getting stronger. Harnesses will be better at that stage. However, once they get to about six months, maybe even five months, they're roughly not much smaller than this. So this will come in handy, especially for training, because they will want to pull, okay? So I promise you, using a harness on one of these dogs at five months or older, you are going to struggle. Okay, obviously training, you can get it to a point where they need it. All I'm saying is this will make things a lot easier. Okay, I will show you how to put this on, uh, so stay tuned for that. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring the camera in a bit closer so we can I can just show you all of the, the parts. So. This here is the main part of the head collar. So the dog's nose comes through here. This hooks round the back of the head. And then you have this extra chain here to secure to your dog's collar. In case they manage to get their face out, you're still secured to the collar. This ring here is where the collar will attach to on the clip. And what happens is, is if they pull, this just slightly tightens and allows it to hold onto the face so you can prevent them from pulling in a direction and you can just pull the face round so that you're then in control rather than them being in control of you. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show putting this on Lulu, okay? So back in a second. So I'm just gonna put this on Lulu now so you can see how this goes on, okay? So nose through. We then take the two clips around the back of the head and the ears. That then clips in together. That's now secured on the head. We now take our chain onto the main ring of the collar. Onto the main ring of the collar. We take our lead. Now we can secure the lead in two places, okay? So first of all, you wanna secure the lead on this ring here. This is where the control happens. So as you can see, she's trying to get up and walk away now. Lou, sit. Good girl. We've got this second part of the lead, which we can actually hook onto the ring as well. So this just gives us extra security if she gets her face out. And all that's gonna happen now, if you look, this is nice and loose. This isn't tight at all, okay? But what happens is, is if she tries to pull, the head collar just tightens around and just gives control and now she's laying down but you get the idea and you've seen that in action and hopefully that helps with you putting the head collar on as well okay so as you can see we're nice and attached Lulu there we go good girl come come there we go and as you can see we just not not too hard just gently okay and we gently can pull her around and get a bit more control of her at the stage of where they're trying to pull and we need to get that training involved so i hope this helps you guys um hopefully we'll see you in the next video thank you for tuning in uh check out our other videos that we've got and if if you'd like and you like what you see please consider subscribing to the channel um We've got some on food, fur, and some other bits and pieces around what's involved in owning these dogs, okay? So thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time. Take care. Bye. I promise you, you will go fly. <laughs> uh, okay, so... This is a two-year-old moving my camera. Thanks for that, Parker.
<laughs> oh God! Mom, Mom, no, I go. Are we still going? <laughs> Where was that? <laughs> it's gonna, it's gonna need a lot of editing, but it's alright because I can chat this at the end. Against okay, Spider-Man. Against <laughs> okay, Spider-Man. Uh, so, where was I? Um, yeah, I promise you that using a harness on these at five months or older 